I'm very happy that I've got uh, two new signings. Um, they are needed in the team, most definitely. Um, I do respect what the office has to do with regards to the recruitment. However, the team still does need uh, certain players in certain positions that will meet the expectations of Kaiser Chiefs and of the fans. The fans also need to know that it, this is not a, 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 a quick uh, transformation of the club to be strong and to have the quality play however uh, definitely we will be signing players that I will not mention yet but they are in line vous savez quoi parce que le club malheureusement on a fait des erreurs les années passées dans des recrutements et pour éviter ces erreurs là on doit être très attentif très prudent et très précis dans le choix de, de joueurs qui veut, euh, qu veut acheter the club has made um, some errors in signing players that were not needed, that were not the quality of Kaiser Chiefs. Um, we need to be very careful how we choose our players, what players we choose, what caliber, what kind of players we, we, we put on the field to meet the expectations. Certes, le marché il est très restreint ici pour le moment. The clubs ne veulent pas nous vendre de joueurs de chez eux. Uh, beaucoup de clubs refusent de nous vendre de joueurs qu'on a besoin d'eux. Comme on a des places très restreintes aussi au niveau des étrangers, c'est très très dur. Mais c'est pas pour cela que je vais acheter n'importe quoi pour le club. On se battra pour avoir de la qualité. Uh, looking at the market that is very tight and very, very closed, a lot of clubs doesn't want to release their players to us. They want to sell their players to us. However, we're still going to need to look, battle, fight to find that right player that we're going to put in the field and give us a plus. Welcome everyone to Spy to this key channel. Let us get the latest of what is in the trend. Um, KZ Chiefs head coach uh, has uh, lambasted uh, and went against uh, KZ Chiefs players to say that some of them are not the top quality players. And he has left out and said that the management has made some errors uh, in electing some of uh, the players uh, to formulate the squad today. And, Case chairs. Hmm. As such, is it seems like new changes, really, really new changes are coming at Chiefs. I remember people like Nabi, they don't work alone. He has his assistants, he has his own technical team. So the assessment is not that something that just come to his mind to say that this is what I decide, this is what I think about. So um, he has discussed this with his team and they have concluded that some of the players are low quality players and not in the standard of his chiefs so we know that nabi has had some few players that he esteemed quality players to bring that case chief so now it's either case chiefs have to do two things officially they'll have to spend money a lot of money in getting quality players that are needed by the coach right and number two case chiefs will have to loan some players which they think are will, uh, quality players for Amakusi, right? So if they don't want to spend big cash, they'll have to go and loan some uh, players, right? But one of the breaking news that we have is that Castine Serino has finally officially signed with Amakusi after being with Mamelodi Sundowns for six uh, uh, past uh, Yes, and finally he became a free agent and now we are told that he uh, was seen, he was spotted there at Nichorena with the boys and it is declared that he has went his uh, medical and Mamelodi Sundowns um, has cleared him because he just became a free agent. As a free agent now it is understood that Serino had received offers from his native South America in Bolivia and Chile, while young Africans of Tanzania and Stellenbosch FC are understood to have also inquired about his services. So um, we know that Serino has now officially made that deal with his chiefs.